morning. Happy Taco Tuesday. We are officially live. Getting started this morning. Getting our week uh, started off uh, going slightly slower than usual. Uh, we'll definitely go over all of the upcoming drops that we got going. We'll also talk about uh, the remainder of this week a little bit, of course, as it gets later into the week and on into the weekend. Things will start to heat up a little bit. But with that said, we had a lot of uh, raffles open up for the Action Brunson 990v6, the Lapis Lazulis. I know a lot of us missed out on that one the first time around definitely want to increase my odds on that I've been entering in uh, I think I've entered into about four of them but we'll go ahead and go over all the raffles uh, we'll get into those as well there's still uh, most of them are still going to be open uh, the remainder of today tomorrow and uh, into Thursday as well uh, then we got a lot of news to talk about uh, we got a uh, new Amma Minier uh, collaboration that uh, is looking quite interesting. Of course, it's on the Jordan 17. We'll get into that as well. We got another Supreme uh, collaboration coming on a Nike SB Darwin Low. Of course, that one's not coming until 2024, but it's always good to look forward. Uh, then we have uh, images of that Eastside Golf uh, 1961 uh, Jordan 1. Uh, we'll take a look at that and get into the calendar uh, for the remainder of the week. Also, uh, with Paris Fashion Week ending, uh, we'll go ahead and take a look at some of the men's street style clothes. Uh, that they were strutting down the runway. We'll also get into uh, the best footwear trends at Passion uh, or at Paris Fashion Week uh, this uh, spring as well. Uh, then we'll go ahead and uh, take a gander at uh, all the raffles again uh, that are open for that Lapis Lazulis and anything else that might go on this morning. Let's go. Good morning. Uh, all right, let's go ahead and pop on. Uh, over to our other window. Let's go ahead and get uh, things going right here. Uh, we got the. All right, yeah, we are ready to go. Um, let's go ahead and pop this one uh, over here. Anything going down uh, first hour? Anything going down first hour? Anyone's comping? I would imagine going to be slightly slow. Uh, at 10 o'clock, there is that Kith Monday program. They do got two uh, different colorways of that uh, vintage tea. Uh, we'll go ahead and pop on over there. I'll just bring that up real quick. That's not going to be going down until 10 o'clock, uh, 10 a.m. Central Time, but uh, we'll take a look. Holy shit! We got an order. Uh, we got the Be a Sponge order out today. Uh, they finally got them shipped. They finally got them shipped out there, uh, so we should be getting those real quick. We also have a WWE Palace collaboration this week we'll take a look at that merch uh that they're dropping on friday uh, over on the palace site as well um there we go we got the uh kith drawing um we have uh entered in at alma Manier. we've entered at kith we've entered at in clothing uh as well uh we also got a bape uh campus 80 uh this week we'll we'll take a look at that as well uh, as we get into the stream, uh, this is going to be the drop today over on Kith. Again, uh, the Monday program, it's the Kith Spiral Vintage T. Uh, going to be a pass for me. Definitely going to be a pass for me. Uh, looks like we got a restock of those Jordan 13 playoffs uh, as well. Uh, then we also had a few sizes restock in that uh, Jordan 3 Dark Iris. Uh, as we get uh, into this morning's drops. Also, that uh, New Balance 9060 uh, in the black in Castle Rock uh, is available in most sizes as well. Uh, just looking at some other small uh, drops on the morning. Uh, then it looks like we got a couple uh, Air Force Ones. We got some Laney's. Uh, a lot of stuff uh, being shipped at a discount. Uh, still got that off-white uh, Nike Air Force One graffiti. Uh, that one, uh, full-size run, still available over there as well. Uh, drop in over on uh, Slam Jam and SNS. Uh, and since we got that Jared, uh, J Jared and Jordan 2, uh, Cherrywood, Smokey! <laughs> <laughs> Let's go. Good morning, fam. What's Gucci, my boy? There we go. Had a pretty good weekend. 
Yeah, off to another one. <laughs> we also got uh, the gold suede, uh, Nike Dunk Low. Looks like they got some more sizes up on HBX, uh, also over on Nike. Uh, and then the Air Force One in that white university blue, uh, that restocked over on Nike as well. It's kind of that uh, Carolina blue colorway. Uh, on the Air Force One. Uh, then it looks like uh, the Q uh, is loaded. There we go. Q's loaded. There they are. <laughs> Old school. Lido. Good morning, fam. Pinkies to the ceiling. Let's get it started. Brrr. Hey, I barely got my coffee out this morning. Barely got the coffee out this morning. As you can see, that pinkies to the ceiling. There we go. Uh, finish sign of JD. We're going to go ahead and open that one up. We're going to go ahead and open that one up. Uh, appreciate you guys rocking with us this morning. Again, going to be a, a, a little bit of a slow start to our week, kind of uh, what we've been used to the last couple weeks. But nonetheless, as we get into the weekend, things should definitely pick up. Yes, sir. All right, let's go ahead and open up JD. Uh, we'll let this thing ring in the background. Uh, just in case anything interesting drops, we'll go ahead and... Um, I'll go ahead and enter into a couple of uh, these windows. I'll get the queue open. Uh, and then after this first drop, we'll get into uh, the latest and the greatest uh, in the world of sneakers. We've got a lot to talk about today. Good morning. Let's go. Good morning. All right. Let's go ahead and pop on over here. Um, yeah, we're loaded up in both of the queues there. Not sure what's going to be loaded up. Not really expecting anything, but you just never know. There we go. We're going to hit refresh on this. All right. Um, and then I'll uh, pull uh, Nike open as well. Looks like we got a reload there. Uh, we also got those uh, Nike Dunk Low Clot cork boards. Uh, those are going to be dropping uh, as well uh, in the upcoming future. I believe we got a Nike sneakers drop. Uh, come in. I don't know if we got a, a time set in stone yet, but uh, I'll definitely uh, update what we do. <laughs> there we go. Smoke puff clouds in the chat. It's getting foggy in here. <laughs> yes, sir. All right, let's go ahead and park on over. Uh, see what else what we got uh, going on. See what else we got going on here. I'm not going to open up uh, anything. Uh, other than my JD, it looks like that's the only one we're going to open up this morning, at least for the first hour. Not expecting anything again. Uh, we'll see if we can't uh, skis our way into uh, either one of these queues uh, to get us going here. Uh, what do you guys think about those those um, um, and years? Um While we're waiting here, I want to pull these up so we can at least look at these bad boys. We got the um, um and year Jordan 17 and man. Oh, man, I'm going to sound like I just, um, I got to say, I'm, I would cop this colorway. <laughs> I would definitely cop this colorway. I think that colorway is fire. Um, the 17 low, eh, I'm kind of 50-50 on that one. I never had one in my entire life. Never actually had a Jordan above a, a, a 14. In my life, so this will be a stretch. But yeah, they're, they're fire, <laughs> Smokey. I know. They're just sweet. I kind of wish they would have on the, the, the front of the midsole. I, I wish that I, um, wouldn't be that speckled. Um, but yeah, I, I definitely like the colors. And they're going to be, uh, looks like, by the sounds of it, they're going to have two different colorways. They're going to have two, uh, very, uh, looking towards the future, uh, 2024 holds even more anticipation as Amam and Yer plans to unveil two captivating uh, color variations of the Amam and Yer Jordan 17 Low. Uh, this precise representation presented here draws inspiration from Amam and Yer's beachfront establishment situated on the Atlantic coast in Folly Beach, South Carolina. Uh, the forthcoming pair will showcase various tones of blue, Drawing inspiration from their cabin location, which is luxury cottage space. The actual location is unknown at this time. Super dope. The Amam and 17, uh, Jordan Low uh, Beach is the colorway. Showcases the captivating sandy be beige colorway, evoking the serene ambiance of a beach. The upper is adorned with this sandy hue, 
creating a visual resemblance to the shoreline. Additionally, the eye stays heel and section of the midsole feature tasteful shades of green and blue, enhancing the overall aesthetic. Emphasizing the collaborative nature of the shoe, the ankles wrapped with a Alma Meniere branding, complemented by a discreet label on the lateral side that elegantly states Alma Meniere Beach. This is pretty cool. I like this one. I'd be uh, definitely interested to see the that other colorway we got going on. Lito's thinking about it. <laughs> yeah. I'm probably going to be warming up to it. Probably going to be warming up to... I, I don't know if they kind of keep... I, I really like that cream colorway on the midsole. Of course, we got those all in your Jordan 5s as well. Uh, going to be dropping a little bit uh, later in the year. I believe those are going to be around uh, holiday time. Let's pop these bad boys up. Uh, we saw uh, uh, an on-foot look at these. We got some pretty decent uh, images of the Jordan 5. I, I really do like these ones as well. I really do like these ones as well. Um, looks like we got a uh, nice uh, short-haired suede. On the upper, we got kind of that off-white, that creme de la creme colorway on the uh, plastic cage there in the middle of the silhouette. Uh, and then on the outsole, we got kind of that, that cream colorway. Uh, the second colorway, uh, we haven't seen images of that. Uh, they're changing it from uh, this gray colorway to more of a light, light baby blue colorway. All right, we just got in over on... We just got in over on JD and uh, finish line. Anything interesting over there? Anything interesting over there? I didn't see if we got uh, anything good. Oh, man, no. It's the Nike Dunk Blue Tint. I don't think they needed a cue for this one. Um, let's see. What do we got up on the top? We got the uh, white and black. Uh, we got the white and black dunk. There's a few sizes left in this one. Uh, and then let's go ahead and scroll down. This is the one that dropped this morning. This is the one that dropped this morning. It looks like there's an 11 uh, still left, which is a men's 9.5. Remember, these are women's sizing uh, in the dunk high. They're kind of a light blue colorway and uh, gray uh, colorway. Oh, it got pandas too? I didn't see that. I didn't see that. Um, Let's take a look. Um, yeah, pandas. Oh, yeah. Full-size run of the pandas, guys. Um, let's see. We got pandas all the way up to, um, looks like a men's 13, men's 14, men's 12. Uh, sold out of the t uh, 12 and a half and 15. Uh, but, yeah, looking like a pretty fresh uh, size run there. Let me go ahead and add, like, a size 10 or something to the cart. See if it adds. Make sure they're not ghosties. Make sure they're not ghosties there. Let's see. Oh, yep. Yeah. Added to bag. Smooth sail in there. Uh, if anyone hasn't yet picked up a panda, well, you still got a little bit of time to do that. <laughs> it's never too late. All right. Let's go ahead and pop on over. I think that was about it uh, for the first hour. Uh, once again, we got that Kith uh, Monday program at 10 o'clock. If either of you guys were going to cop those T-shirts. And we got the vintage spiral T uh, dropping over on Kith, top of the hour. There we go. Oh, uh, sorry, the clot is dropping on six thirty. So clot is gonna. This is gonna be added to our drop list as well. For some reason, it's not loaded up on Nike sneakers yet. I don't think. Let's go ahead and take a gander. Uh, let's go ahead and pull from the latest. Uh, they should be updating it. I would imagine at any time. Uh, it's still not updated in the app. Uh, but let me go ahead and pop on over. Uh, we also got that Nike SB uh, in the black fog colorway. Uh, we talked about this uh, a couple weeks ago. But uh, they will be uh, restocking uh, around holiday 2023. Uh, that purple and black SB. We'll also be restocking, and then uh, the wheat uh, colorway will also be restocking uh, around holiday. And we also have all those collaborations coming as well. Uh, holiday, November, December is going to go absolutely crazy. <laughs> Smokey, uh, did I get my sisters? I did, Smokey, I, but I got her the, I ended up buying her the Panda Highs. 
She wanted the high tops. <laughs> I tried talking her into the low tops. She didn't want them. She didn't want them. Pinkies up. But yeah, we do have these cork clots. Uh, dropping on sneakers on the 30th. So that's just three days away. All right, let me get to the top here and refresh. All right. Yeah, 630. Uh, I don't know if they're loaded up on your guys' uh, sneakers app, but uh, mine still doesn't have them loaded up. Uh, but you'll get another rip at those as well uh, this week. All right. All right, let's go ahead and pop on over to the next thing we got to talk about. Uh, Supreme uh, is going to be collaborating on the uh, Nike SB Darwin Low. Uh, if you guys remember this one, Dennis Rodman used to wear the high top version of this bad boy. This is going to be a sweet collab. It, I mean... This looks like about as I like as close of like like a Jordan. It's almost like a Jordan ten meets like an Ashad wear. <laughs> uh, super super good looking shoe. I think they're almost just as good looking as an SB to keep it a hundo pundo. There we go. Um, my frog, my Crocs finally shipped. Hey, so Smokey, <laughs> I think mine. I uh, get here today. I got an email saying that I think they're out for delivery. It might have been that they were just leaving. I'm not sure if I misread, but I think they're they're getting here today, which will be wild. Which will be wild. Doxas, what up? What up? What up, my boys? In the house, what's happening? Doxas, voo, let's get it. What's Gucci, my boys? There we go. Oh man, yeah, this one. I'm telling you. Uh, I don't know if there it's in good hands over at, at Supreme with the collab, but a great silhouette. Great silhouette. Looking uh, forward to uh, the materials that they'll use. Uh, we also got, uh, just taking a look at these. All right. Let's go ahead and pop these ones. All right, um, let's go ahead and pop uh, over. Let's go ahead and take a look at the Dennis Rodman. So these were like the highs back in the day. If if some of you guys, younger guys, don't remember. Old Dennis Rodman was used to have the backward swoosh for the Travis Scott collabs. We have these bad boys. These are just beasts. Just peace. But um, this one, the low is better than the highs. I'm glad they're working on the on the low. It's definitely more of a, a skate shoe. Uh, but with that said, uh, let's go ahead and pull up Dennis. Well, you guys saw that right there. Old D-Rod. Here we go. In San Antonio days. There we go. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. How we doing? How we doing? There we go. Um, this morning we're just uh, gonna be going over uh, most of the sneaker news, and then we'll go ahead and take a gander at uh, all of the raffles that are open. So you guys can go ahead and get into those uh, if you're gonna be looking uh, at copping those action Brunsons. I'm gonna need all the chances I can get, so I'm gonna enter all those. We'll go over those, uh, and then we'll also. Uh, talk a little bit uh, about the remainder of the week and everything else uh, that we got dropping uh, as well. Uh, once we go over all the sneaker news, for sure. Appreciate you guys rocking with us, smashing that thumb button, getting us going in that algorithm, turning on the notifications, sharing the videos. Whoop, whoop. Also, uh, sending out good luck and good vibes your way. You know it. Uh, but nonetheless, uh, we should uh, definitely uh, see these, I would say, probably early 2024. Uh, as well, uh, we still got a uh, Supreme uh, collab coming out before that, which I'm sure most of us are looking forward to. Uh, we got the Rommel Z. Speaking of, I, I hate I hate giving you guys the bad news, but I try to sprinkle a little good news in with it. Unfortunately, 
Next month's collaboration's been delayed. Next month's collaboration's been delayed, but uh, we'll just uh, hang on tight, of course. We got that born and raised. Uh, that one got moved back a little bit, so hopefully that'll kind of take up for the lackluster month that we got going without these. Uh, but with that said, they'll just be moved back, so our schedule uh, will get a little bit better one week uh, when they add them. Uh, but unfortunately, right now, they did move uh, those back. Kind of was wondering what they were going to do when they uh, moved the born and raised one to uh, July 21st. But at least we got that one uh, next month. The show. Uh, man, I really want all those uh, Powell uh, Blacklight decks on Premiere today. But kind of pricey. I didn't, I didn't see those. Doc says. Um, we got some, what the, some Blacklight decks. Oh, man. They're all, uh, yeah, they're, those are wild. They're, uh, looks like they're kind of, they're cruiser decks. So they're, uh, more made for, like, the, the bigger wheel, 70 millimeter. Well, pretty much 55 and up. Uh, your cruiser wheel's gonna be a little bit wider. Of course, they don't have, uh, symmetrical ends on each side. Uh, but definitely a good, uh, board if you just, uh, wanna hang them. Yeah, they, uh, definitely got some dope. Graphics on them for sure. And the cruiser board, you get a little bit of a, a wider spot to, to mount the graphics as well. <laughs> for sure. There we go. All right. Um, it in Discord, uh, the, the boards. Did I see that? Uh, let's pop open. Oh, there it is. Old school. My boy. Nice, nice. Uh, looks like there's going to be, um, what, one, two, three, six of them? Dropping. I, I would definitely cop one if they were either 8.25 or 8.38. Uh, in that range, I would definitely pick one of those up. There we go. All right. Uh, that, that's going to be dropping at what time, 11? 11 a.m.? Yeah, in store at 11. Uh, and then the remaining will be online, meaning uh, inventory going to be online. All right. Let's see what else uh, we got going on here. Uh, anything else uh, this morning that caught your guys' eye? I think we can probably move on. Let me just double check. Uh, looks like there are uh, quite a few dunks uh, still restocking, both on Nike and Finish Line. Uh, nothing too interesting there. And uh, we still got plenty of sizes of pandas uh, over on uh, Finish Line JD Sports. You know it. You know it. All right. Let's go. The Fireberry Air Force Ones. <laughs> we got a bright pink. Uh, look at an Air Force One here. Uh, the Fireberry. These kind of remind me of those Nike Dunk Lows, those Fuchsia Dunks uh, that we had. I actually got a pair of those. I actually got a pair of those. Uh, reminiscent of the Cosmic Fuchsia uh, Nike Dunk High. Uh, let's go ahead and pop that one up. Uh, Cosmic. Oh, that was the, yeah, the ambush one that dropped, that bricked. All those dunks were, in my opinion, quite fugly. Uh, blue tile? Blue tile's dropping them over there? All right. All right, let's go ahead and pop on over here. Let's go ahead and pop on over to the next thing uh, that we got going on. I'm excited about this Darwin. I think they should. I think they should uh, do a collab on the Air Max 96. I would love uh, some. This almost reminds me of that that Saucony, that Saucony collab. Um. That dropped uh, the J Tips one. The J Tips one.
Uh, the Air Max 96 kind of gives me similar vibes to the, what is this, the Grid 3D? Oh, sorry, the Azra 2000. There we go on this one. There we go. All right, let's go ahead and pop over. Uh, last stream, we did see uh, two new colorways, of course, uh, in that Salehi Benberry uh, 1906. We also saw uh, Action Brunson wearing a pretty dope uh, pair of green uh, 1906s. Let me just pull these uh, both up really quick. Uh, we talked about them um, a little bit last stream. Um all right, so we got the uh, Salehi ones are going to be kind of this red and uh, yellow pair. Uh, and then we also have the Action Brunson pair, uh, 1906s, uh, that I would say uh, we should start seeing uh, next month. Uh, and then we also got that third colorway of the Action Brunson 990V6. If you weren't able or if you're not able to pick up a Lapis Lazuli this week, uh, then uh, we do still have one remaining colorway. And then it looks like uh, he's going to uh, move on to a different silhouette, uh, which is super, super cool as well. I'm always a big fan of those. Uh, then over the weekend, we got Miss Jeff. Sneaking up on us with a Kid Cudi collab on the Super Normal 2. And this one is looking fire, in my opinion. <laughs> Doc says, uh, anyone's Lapis uh, Lazuli ship yet? Um, I did not cop that, but I would imagine that the processing, um, usually when they we cop on their, um, like the websites, uh, whether it's Soleil Benberry, um, Action Brunson, um, Fear of God. Fear, Fear of God usually is a little bit quicker depending on what releases, but usually it takes about a week to process and get out. Uh, just kind of depending on the place. I'll just keep an eye on it. Doxis, for sure. Yeah, sometimes they come out a little bit slow uh, from the personal uh, websites, unfortunately. I li like, I'm just getting my uh, Slay Benberry Croc uh, this week. I believe I get it today, but um, it might have just got shipped out today. Hopefully, it'll get in today. Um, there we go. What do you guys think of these mischief? <laughs> Super normals. Oh, man. Uh, expect newbie. Uh, African Food said, expect new balance in three weeks. Um, yep. For sure. Yeah, that's a good little time frame. The Super Normal 2. Looks like it's got some interesting materials on these bad boys. They actually look really good uh, in this colorway. Almost looks like a Landvin uh, a skate shoe. Speaking of, uh, we have S, uh, the skate brand S, uh, going to be pretty much where Landvin um, got, I mean, it's similar, similar look to the Landvins that we see nowadays. Uh, but where it all started uh, back in the early days, uh, we got the Ez, uh, the Muska. Flacco going to love this one. Um, this one going to be uh, dropping uh, spring 2024. So if you love the Landvin silhouette, uh, this one, even the Supras, uh, back before their day. Uh, this one with some fat laces. Would be it for me. <laughs> these are fire. I don't know how many pairs of these I used to rock back in the day. Uh, those are clean African food. <laughs> are you talking about the mischief? I think they're fire. I think they're fire. I mean, the shoe off the rip was made pretty good quality. Like, every time I looked at these, I was like, damn. 
the leather on them looks really good, but they are, you know, they are expensive. They were like two twenty. I would pay two twenty for this this shoe. I'm not a big Kid Cudi fan, but he definitely knocked it out the park on this one. I, I like this one. Great skate shoe. I'm definitely going to give him a rip. Uh, we should see these dropping as well. We got the Crocs. <laughs> the Crocs boot on the mischief side. Some stuff is a, hit, a swing and miss, but other stuff kind of slaps. Uh, the bottom kind of got that Tiffany blue colorway. <laughs> yeah, these are fire. I like them. Got the fat laces in them. And then uh, the material almost looks like that, that teddy bear or that chenille material that we see on a lot of the Varsity jackets. It looks similar to those. Uh, Doxis, uh, my Pollux Horchata shipped out today. Dang, so mine must not be coming today. Mine must be just getting here. Uh, let, me th let me double check. Let me double check. Let's go on over to the shop app. Oh, whoops. Yeah, I'm pretty sure that they... I thought they got here today, but let me uh, take a double, a double look real quick. All right, there it is. Oh yeah, mine mine does arrive today. Wow. Usually mine gets here. Usually last, um, but it will. Uh, looks like beginning here today. Orchata. And we got those ones from the actual site. We got those from his site. Uh, then we got also got this week, we got Bend Over Becky. Blasi's dropping uh, the Bend Over Becky ashtray on Friday. Might be a merch week <laughs> this week for sure. For sure. Let's go ahead. Um, and pop that one up. All right. And then uh, we also, uh, this week, kind of going down the line, uh, also a WWE Palace uh, collaboration. Going to be dropping on Friday. Uh, they got a few items on the board here. Nothing too crazy. Uh, no figures. It's mostly just uh, clothing. Um, but we can take a, a little bit, <laughs> a little bit of look uh, in here. All right. I'm just going to pop up a couple of the items over on the uh, palace side. Oops. Had the, th oh, editing the old thumbnail there. All right, let's go ahead and pop on over to the palace. Um, and I'm also looking for the anime. Um, I did see some things. I was reading a French uh, sneaker blog, and uh, they did have these uh, listed up for next weekend. Um, so I don't know if that will change, but I'll definitely be keeping an eye on the 610s. Uh, we also, speaking of 610 New Balance, uh, we did see a CDG collaboration also on the 610. Yep. Let's go ahead and pop that one up. Uh, there we go. I, I think there's just a white and a black colorway. Uh, usually what CDG does. Um, but we saw a 1906. And then we also see a 610 New Balance here. Uh, both in the uh, white and black colorways. Uh, this one won't be dropping uh, till 2024. Uh, for all of our New Balance fans out there. You know it. Oh, man. Then we got the Basuda. Well, speaking of, let's just stay on CDG. Uh, we have also the Kama, De Garcon, Nike ECG, Mountain Fly Low. We got two different colorways for these as well. 
Uh, we got the white and then kind of that that black uh, and white colorway, kind of the panda colorway there. Uh, then we go out on to the Basuda of the week. We got the Rick Owens medical boot in a couple different styles. This one's going to be a couple different styles. This one might make you puke a little bit in your mouth. Uh, but, of course, you can see kind of the uh, side there, the side profile of the foot. Looking probably as, as gangly as it could. And uh, now you see the full front there with two big straps. 2023 might be the year of the, the medical boot. Hopefully you don't need it, though. <laughs> For sure. All right, let's go ahead and pop on over there. I just wanted to pop those up real quick. And then we got uh, confirmation. Uh, another good collab, Jordan 1, Union, Bethany Beauty Supply. Uh, Going to be dropping August 26th. Hopefully we don't get anything moved back. We're exactly two months away. Uh, we got also got some really good collaborations in between now and then. As you guys know, that watch the channel quite a bit. We got a lot of great SB collaborations. I don't even know how they're going to fit them all in between now and holiday. We're going to start getting a real, real fire week or month uh, once they, they kind of cram them in there uh, for sure. Appreciate you guys for that, that thumb button. Give it a big booty slap. Really helps get us into the algorithm. Definitely can't do it without you guys. Appreciate you guys rocking with us each and every morning. This morning, you know it. Big shout out uh, to everyone around the world. Saluting. All right. Big salutes from east to west coast. All right. We took a look at the Salehi uh, New Balance already. Uh, then uh, over on the Travis Scott site. Uh, we do have a password page up. And I believe uh, there's a pre-order page, or there was. Let's go ahead and take a look at these bad boys. All right. There we go. So... We got a placeholder set up. Super excited about this one. We should see uh, the SBs, I would imagine, come out uh, around when they drop this album. Uh, so uh, the quicker they get all the marketing and... Uh, advertisements up, uh, the quicker uh, we'll get those bad boys. And you know our uh, SB schedule is already jam-packed. Of course, we're, we're right now, we got the Born and Raised on July 21st. We'll just kind of take a, a quick little gander at some of our upcoming SBs. Uh, right now, again, guys, we unfortunately had to give the bad news uh, this morning. Uh, the Rommel Z Supreme Nike SB uh, is going to be delayed. Uh, it's going to be delayed. We don't have a, a tentative date uh, as of right now. Uh, we also have those uh, purple suede's uh, going to be sprinkled uh, in between the Born and Raised and the Yudo Horigami uh, Nike SB. This one's going to be dropping in August. Uh, then, of course, we just saw those Albino and Predo on foot looks uh, looking like uh, those are going to be dropping in September. And then, of course, uh, we got Crenshaw Skate Club. Uh, we also have April Skateboards. We got Powerpuff Girls. Uh, we got Carhartt. And um, we also got the Travis Scott uh, Nike SBs as well. You know it. Uh, and then, of course, we talked about it a little bit uh, in earlier in the stream. Uh, the Supreme SB Darwin. Uh, this one is going to be rumored for 2024. Super, super stoked about that one as well. Uh, then we also have uh, images of the East Side Golf Air Jordan 1 High 1961. I don't know. There's something about East Side Golf collabs that just don't get me excited at all. 
Um, I don't like the tag on the, the front of these. I don't like this golf tag, um, especially on this shiny ribbon that they put it on. They, they put it on like a silk. It's just not it. That's just not it. I, I, that's one thing I, I haven't liked about uh, even the uh, the last collaboration, uh, the East Side Golf collaboration. I didn't like the last one either because of that. Um, that was a Jordan one. This was a better colorway, but um, this that one had the golf. That one had the golf, but it's still that that shiny ribbon material. You know that orange. It looks a little bit better with the Jordan logo on this one than it does on on the East Side logo. I, I just don't really like the East Side logo. Period. Yeah, no offense to to a man uh, <laughs> going on his backstroke, but SP schedule getting moved around. <laughs> Not liking that, right? Oh man. Well, they gotta hopefully once they move them around, they move a bunch to. Like for one month, and then we can get maybe three or four collaborations in a month. <laughs> yes, <laughs> another shoe I could use to park in the handicap stop. Holy cow, we're getting free handicap parking <laughs> with our footwear. Is that for the medical boot? Yeah, <laughs> hey, cannabis camp, <laughs> my boy. Good morning, fam. How we doing? There we go. All right, let's go ahead and pop on over here see what else we got cooking. Um, I don't know if I missed anything there in the background. Uh, looks like we got an a Air Max 90. Pretty cool colorway in the white and pink colorway. Uh, that's going to be over on Finish Line JD Sports. Uh, $10 off with code JDS10. Uh, then we also, looks like we got some Nike Court Vintage uh, in the white and gum uh, colorway. Those are over on Nike as well. Nothing really catching my eye. Uh, Finish Line and JD, of course, do have uh, those pandas. Finish Line JD, do we got the pandas still? Uh, if anyone is uh, still looking for a size in those bad boys. All right, let's just take a look at, at more of this shoe. Uh, we got the East Side Golf font uh, in the check right here in the swoosh. Uh, then on the bottom heel, we got the change word. And then... We got like a, a gold Jordan Wings logo and just, I'm telling you, this tag is p just awful. This is awful. They should have changed that, even if it was after the first sample. It doesn't, I mean, it feels like the greens don't even really match there. It's such a weird material too, that sh that ribbon. It's like when you, when you make a ribbon, it's that same material. If you scratch it, that stuff snags. Yeah. And the logo just, you know, it's, it's especially next to that Air Jordan Wings logo, especially in that kind of that gold, that premium color there. Ooh, it's a tough one to look at next to, <laughs> right? <laughs> Pretty good. Uh, been busy. Uh, what are we copping or uh, what do we cop lately? Jeez, oh, I tell you what, um, I got my, I ended up getting my Yeezy stuff in. Uh, they ended up canceling one order. I know we're kind of going a, a ways back there. Um, but I, I ended up getting that stuff. Uh, the Puma, uh, the Puma um, bait flash uh, shoe I got from Foot Locker. Um, ended up getting that one in. I got the sporty, the sporty and rich Adidas. This was the last one that that came in. Um, and then I also got the the uh, Slay Benberry Crocs. Coming as well. Um, but I feel like we got the best colorway on this one. Um, and then we also got... Oh, we got those Bodega. Those Bodega 610s. Bodega 610s. And I think that is it's about it for my late pickups. I'm not really waiting for anything either. We haven't uh, hit... In about a week or so. I don't think we copped anything last week. No, because we missed out on the Action Brunsons. We really, of course, wanted those. And then we ended up not copping the Pumas. And, it, and she kind of went down the hill from there. 
All right. So these ones also going to be dropping. I'd rather just have the pine greens, honestly. Um, instead of getting the, the east sides, I'd rather just have the pine green ones. Or the pine green SBs would probably even slap a little bit harder. But the, yeah, this one I think would be the better option. For sure. My opinion. I just realized I got a dub on the Crocs. Still probably going to cop most of that Yeezy uh, resale soon. Uh, oh, the the new stuff cannabis? Like the granite slides? Let's go ahead and take a look at, at the... Not only the upcoming Yeezys, but I want to take a look at that Bape shoe that's dropping uh, this weekend as well. It's going to be their 30th anniversary shoe. Uh, going to be a collaboration between Bape and Adidas here. Uh, the drawing is going to be July 1st. Drawing is going to be July 1st. What do you guys think of these? Um, I think I got a bigger, bigger window. I think I got a bigger window here. Yeah. All right. Let's take a gander. Uh, it looks like they're going to be just like the navy blue ones that dropped. I don't mind a good. Uh, I don't mind these babe collabs, but the price tag at one fifty. I was thinking like one twenty. Um, but materials are nice. I I do like the campus eighty. Um, it's probably one of my low key favorite silhouettes. Probably that one in the in the superstar. At least when I was younger. Now they're not so not not as comfortable as I'd like. But I do like this colorway. I do like this colorway. Yeah. Uh, Smokey, uh, those, aren't, those aren't bad. And the, the bape, just wouldn't wear them. Yeah. Kind of still deciding on these ones. I like them better than the navy colorway. I like them a little bit better than the navy colorway. I wish they were dropping them in uh, maybe like a black colorway. Um, but yeah, you got the 30 on the uh, tongue there. Again, I think for for like 120, I think I'd be a taker, but 150 a little high on those. 150 a little high on those. Uh, those are gonna be dropping on July 1st. So those are gonna be coming up as well. Uh, then we move on to the Jordan 4 military blues. Uh, we've talked about these a little bit. I love this shoe. Always have this one. Probably just as nostalgic for me is even the the bread Jordan 4. I wanted these ones just as bad. Um, look at the OG. Look at when they dropped the first year. Damn, they were a way different color. I love the color they are now. They're almost like the Detroit Lions colorways, but back in the day, they were a little bit darker. They were a little bit darker. God dang it. Uh, African food. I got the original joints. Uh, black and white bait. Uh, fire shoe. Quality pretty nice. African food. Yeah, I would like the black pair going to be the best, right? That's a good colorway on those bad boys. For sure. I like vape shoes in general. I just don't really like the retail prices of them. Always been a fan of them. I, I've more been a fan of the ones with the patent leather. Of course, uh, I love when they do the like the collaborations, the Marvel collab. Uh, we hadn't seen a lot of collaborations uh, like they used to do in like the mid two thousands. Uh, we started to see a little bit more last year, but then Nike uh, came out uh, with that lawsuit, and and since then I, we haven't gotten a collaboration since that Marvel one. You know, but even the collaboration, you know, the three hundred. It's a little steep, in my opinion. All right, let's go ahead and take a look uh, at Dime's new collaboration with Asics. I've been coming around to the Asics big time, uh, especially I feel like uh, in the last month or so, uh, ever since, uh, well, even last year, we could go back to that Jound uh, collaborations on the Gel Kyano 14. Uh, then we just had that cool kid. A drop. I didn't end up getting a W. That was just last week. That's another one I missed out on. Both that one and the Action Brunson's. I wanted pretty bad. 
Uh, with that said, I've been definitely been a fan of the Asics. I'm just not digging these. I'm not digging either color of these. There's only like a certain way I, I have to have my Asics. And these these just not it. Either of these bad boys. Uh, but Dime does have a decent collaboration uh, coming up uh, as well on that 1906 silhouette that we saw. Uh, Action Brunson and Salehi Benberry. Uh, we saw those two new colorways uh, on both of theirs. There we go. Now let's go ahead and take a look at uh, some of the best footwear trends uh, from Paris Fashion Week. Of course, just wrapping up uh, two weeks ago, uh, we had tons of stuff to look at. Probably my most impressed has got to be the Fear of God stuff. I think I think Jerry was a, uh, took it home, complete winner in this one. Yeah, that Marva collab was dope, but four hundred retail. Yeah, it was expensive. It was four hundred. I thought it was three hundred. Dang, it was that much. Yeah, they were expensive. I I liked them, but I think two hundred would have been nice. Two hundred would have been nice. Um, no, they definitely weren't 200 retail. The stock X is sometimes they're off in their retail prices. <laughs> they definitely weren't 200. Oh, 349. Yeah, 349 plus tax. Yeah, they would have been over 400. <laughs> Old school. I th I feel like they were like a little bit cheaper if you would have uh, ordered them off the Japan site. If you can read Japanese, that is. That was a little tough. All right, so, all right, let's go ahead and take a look at some of the, the, the trends. Most of them going to be probably the higher fashion uh, brands. Balenciaga. Balenciaga. What do we got here? These look like a space boot, similar. Almost looks like a, a, a snowboarding boot from the side. Ooh, then we got the Dior Birkenstocks here. All right. There we go. Um, then we got, ooh, the Terminators. Wow. Imagine going to Paris Fashion Week and wearing these. Oh, that's probably just a ticket straight home. God dang it. Imagine all the shoes you could wear and you bust out the Terminators. <laughs> Holy shit. <laughs> it's like sleeping all day in Express. <laughs> oh, then we got, what do we got? The KLRs? These almost giving me kind of those mischief vibes. Yeah. This is definitely out of my league right here. <laughs> Holy Basuda of the week right here. It looks like your the heel looks like two ravioli noodles. <laughs> that you're standing on. Holy, those are fugly. <laughs> yeah. Oh. No. Oh, no, that was just darn it. Ooh, these are fire. These are fire. We got the Louis Vuitton trainer here. Got a little bit of a a spike on the heel. Interesting. Dior uh, Burks with plain white socks. Oh, there's Terminators for CDG. I know, but they're still bad, right? <laughs> uh, I guess, yeah, we will give them the collab. We will give them the collab. They weren't a GR, but, oh, imagine. I don't know. <laughs> and then we got the This Is Never That. New Balance, 1906, of course. This is the one that we just saw, Salehi. Uh, in action, Brunson, Spartan. Uh, definitely looking forward to both of these. All right, this was action, Brunson's take on them. <laughs> Smokey was still bad, yes. <laughs> uh, this is never that. I don't mind the the... Like, I don't know how I felt about the This Is Never That collaboration right away because you got some of those, like, you know, like the dirt spots on them, but I kind of like them. I really do. 
And then, of course, on the right, we got the uh, Action Brunson, uh, 1906. Uh, then let's go ahead and pull up the... Salehi. Uh, 1906 there. Uh, looks like we're going to get quite a few different collaborations on this. Uh, we also got uh, two CDG colorways of the uh, 1906. All right, let me just pull this one up real quick. Oh, the I didn't realize that it had a black heel on it. The white one, I think, looks a little bit better. Of course, you're not going to get uh, too many other colors in black and white with CDG. Uh, but it looks like they're going uh, down the rabbit hole with the uh, 1906 collaborations there. Ooh, then we got a, a New Balance 9060. This one's a GR colorway. This one's a pretty nice colorway, actually. I like that New Balance hit on, on the back heel. Uh, we got kind of a brown and, and cherry almost. Like a brown and maroon. Pretty nice colorway there on this one. Again, a lot of the uh, 90 60 silhouettes have just been going crazy on the aftermarket. Especially that Bricks and Woods. Uh, that we got the JFG. Got some good 9060s here, and they're not going to get any cheaper. Even the bigger sizes in this one's starting to go crazy. Ooh, we that size six, though. Last sale, 500. Uh, Bricks and Wood also doing numbers on this same silhouette. Uh, they have released a lot of good uh, GR colorways, though. Um, then we got, uh, let's see, 577 for a size seven. Last sale, 420. They're creeping up there. Great shoe, though. Great shoe. All right. Then we got... I'm not sure what this one is. Not sure what this one is. Almost looks like kind of like a Rachi Midi. It's like a Puma MB01. Hey, here we go. Here we got the Super Normal. Now we can do a little side-by-side -side on these bad boys. There we go. And, of course, we just looked at that Kid Cuddy. Collaboration. All right. It's probably the best pick I'll, I'll have of that one. Um, again, the, the, the materials, like the leather on this shoe, they got the ripple leather quality. looks pretty good on the Mischief. All right, then we'll pop on over. We got the Stussy Penny 2 in the green colorway. Uh, old school is a clean colorway in the 96, right? That was a pretty nice colorway. Uh, then we got the Sakai. Oh, crap. Ronnie, straight from Amsterdam. <laughs> da, da, da. There we go. We got the wood shoes. You know it. That had to have been because of Ronnie, <laughs> my boy. A big shout out uh, to Ronnie if he's in here. You know it. All right. Uh, let's see what else we got going on. Uh, we're about eight minutes away from the top of the hour. Eight minutes away. All right. Nothing over there. Um, looks like the, the Stussy, speaking of, um, we had that Air Penny 2, um, that black one. There's still a bunch of sizes. Uh, in this one as well, uh, if anyone is interested. In this one, the clogs. <laughs> God dang it. Uh, those just look like you're going to have a sore back at the end of the day. At the end of the day. Um. All right. Uh, tomorrow, uh, we got a raffle over on CCS. Another raffle. I did just enter for that black gum. Uh, Nike SB. This one is going to be the white gum. 
It's going to be that white with the black swoosh. And then, of course, the gum bottoms. Uh, that's going to be dropping tomorrow, 9 uh, to 10 o'clock in the morning, Central Time. I uh, just wanted to give you guys a heads up on that one. Uh, then let's go ahead and uh, go over all of the open raffles uh, for that action. Brunson, 990 V6 in the Lappies, Lazuli, uh, Colorway. Uh, we got a few to go over, so let's get into it. Let's get into it. All right. Um, we right. Let's start by uh, opening up SNS. This one is actually going to be closing first. So I wanted to open this one up first. All right. Um, and then let's go ahead and put, open up signups. Uh, we got the Lapis Lazuli. Um, it's going to be open all day today and tomorrow. And it's going to be closing on Thursday morning. Again, we're over on the SNS app. All right, and then uh, we go ahead and cruise on over to the Kith app, uh, which isn't far away. Let's go ahead and open up that one. Uh, I am entered in both of these, okay? So if you want to increase your chances, I know a lot of you guys wanted these. Uh, as you can see on there, already entered. Uh, this one is up on the app as well. Uh, we got Kith. Uh, we got SNS. Okay, let's go ahead and open up end clothing as well because these are ones I've already entered. We're already entered in these bad boys. Uh, let's go ahead and open up the launch tab on the end uh, clothing app. Let's go ahead and get this bad boy open. Spread it open. Let's get in for the win. You know it. Uh, they also got the Adidas NSRC. Uh, collab in both uh, two different colors there. One on the Campus 80, the other one on the Superstar. Uh, we also got that Teddy Pack uh, made in USA, 990V4 on that purple colorway. And then uh, right here we got the uh, New Balance Action Brunson uh, right there. I'm going to go ahead and uh, pop up the... Ooh. All right. And then, okay, so we got End Clothing. Uh, we got Kith. Uh, we got SNS. Uh, let's go ahead and pop on over to Up the Restore. Up the Restore also has their raffle open as well. There we go. Uh, Doc says he just <laughs> entered on N2. Let's go. Hey, we got we got to get in early. We got to get in a dirty, uh, Doc says, goes, SNS, Kith, I'm on in here, and social. All right, well, let's get in on Up the Restore. Up the Restore. Uh, if you guys need the link, let's go ahead and put that one in there. Uh, then let's go ahead and move right on over uh, to I'm on in here. Uh, we got the I'm on in here one. I, I'm also in the I'm on in here and social status one. I'm in this one, and then social status right over here. Um, we're going to enter both of these. These are both going to be EQL raffles. Uh, you can enter both of them. This is the Amma Manier. Okay, and then this one is social status. This one is social status. All right, let's get these. Okay, and then remember... Uh, in the Kith app, uh, just don't go ahead and open up your uh, Kith app. I don't have uh, the link to that one, uh, but you can enter via Kith app. That is the only way you can enter into that one. Uh, then SNS, I also entered in the app and end clothing, as you guys can see. Uh, we've already entered in that one uh, as well. All right, let's go ahead and take a look uh, at what else we got here. Um, now let's go on over. Uh, to BSTN, uh, BSTN got their raffle open as well. Uh, one day, 22 hours. Uh, this one is going to close about the same time uh, as SNS. All right. All right. Once again, BSTN raffle. All right. All right, we got end, Amma Munir, BSTN, Kith, SNS, and then up there, or up the restore. 
uh, as well. All right. Um, and then in app, uh, we got SNS, Kith, and End uh, Clothing. There you can see on my phone right there. I'm on Minier and social status. We're already entered into both of those. All right. Let's go ahead and pop on over. Let's go ahead and pop on over to. Uh, the other raffles here. Make sure I'm not missing anything. We got BSTN, and uh, that is looking like uh, most of them for now. Uh, we could still see a couple open. Uh, I don't think Bodega has opened up yet. Let me double check. Yep, no, didn't see it on there. Uh, so that looks like uh, we got that one uh, covered, uh, at least for right now. So just real quick, we got SNS app, we got the Kith app, uh, we got End Clothing uh, as well, uh, and then over on to... Uh, my main monitor here, we got BSTN, uh, we got Up the Restore, Um Amanier, and Social Status. There we go, seven for seven, <laughs> hopefully. Uh, good luck again. Good luck, everyone that did uh, get into the draw. Uh, we will uh, be copying these over on the New Balance site on June 30th. Uh, that'll be a drop uh, going down the same day as the Nike Sneakers app. Uh, we got the uh, clot dunks uh, dropping over there uh, on the same day. Those are both going to be June 30th. All right. Let's go ahead and pop on over. Uh, anything else go down? Anything else uh, go live at the top of the hour? Let me go ahead and take a look at the monitor. Should be a pretty, pretty quiet morning this morning. I know a lot of stuff is restocking. Still got some more of those pandas. Still got some more of those pandas. Let's just pop on over there. Take a look at the sizes. For you guys. Also got a lot of good deals out there. I know uh, Mr. Porter had a lot of stuff on sale. They did have uh, a couple things. We'll go ahead and, and take a quick gander over there. Um, it looks like the the low, uh, the low pandas, at least in the adult sizes, um, look to be cooked. Uh, got some little kids, also toddler, uh, still left uh, over there on JD Sports, and yeah, it looks like the uh, pandas got eaten up over there. But you guys should have been able to. Get in there and get your size if that was something that you were interested in. Uh, then let's go on over to Mr. Porter. Again, they got uh, some stuff uh, up to 60% off. I know they did have that ambush. Uh, Air Force One for like 100 bucks, 110 120 114 uh, 40% off there. Uh, the green one, they did have uh, bigger sizes in. Uh, they also had quite a few pairs of Vans. Um, and some Air Force Ones uh, for um, 50 or 40% uh, off as well. Uh, over on Mr. Porter again, uh, got some decent sales. JD Sports finish line. Uh, you can um, use your points, of course. Uh, if you guys are interested in anything, I did cash uh, or redeem one of my awards. Uh, just kind of waiting for that one. I got, uh, I believe, uh, still about uh, 20 or 30 days to use that as well. Uh, Friday going to be a fun day. Definitely going to get start heating up. That is definitely sh for sure. Uh, let's go ahead and pop on over. Uh, take a quick look over here. See if I missed anything. Uh, the Nike Air Zoom. Uh, Vimero 5 uh, sizes still available over on Slam Jam. I know these dropped at, at quite a few different places. Uh, they got sizes 8 and up. Uh, looks like smaller sizes did sell out uh, in that Vimero. Uh, Air Max Scorpion FK, 
uh, going to be over on JD Sports. Uh, also, the women's Air Max 90 in that soft pink colorway uh, sizes still available over on Finish Line. Uh, then let's go ahead and scroll down. We got the Zoom Diamond uh, Turf uh, in the black and wolf gray. Uh, that one is available over on Nike uh, as well. Um, I believe uh, Summer 20 uh, will get you uh, 20% off, an extra 20% off over there on Nike. Uh, then we got the Air Max LTD 3 in the smoke gray. That also available on Nike. Uh, the Court Legacy Canvas in the olive colorway uh, and the Court Vintage Premium all available on Nike. Uh, Women's Dunk High in that light blue and gray colorway available over on JD Sports. Uh, also that white and black dunk. Uh, looks like uh, the size has gotten eight and up on that as well. Uh, Air Max 97, uh, cow print over on Nordstrom. Also, Air Max 97s uh, for uh, right around $100 over on uh, Nike as well. They do got some pretty good prices. Uh, also, JD Sports and Finish Line uh, also have the uh, Blue and Volt Air Max 97 uh, for a pretty decent price. Uh, then we got the Air Max 90 and the Obsidian uh, in track red. That's also available over on Nordstrom. Uh, looks like quite a bit of stuff restocked over on Nordstrom uh, this past weekend. Uh, on the right-hand side there, you also see those uh, Air Max 90s. Uh, then we also had the grade school Air Force One split blue. Uh, that's going to also be available over on Nordstrom. Uh, then the women's uh, Jordan 1. Or sorry, no, that was the Air Force One. All right. And that looks like about it uh, for this morning. Upcoming releases, of course. On the 29th, on Thursday, we got that uh, Teddy Santis uh, made in the USA pack. As you guys can see right over there, I'm going to go ahead and pull them up on the big screen here. Uh, we got that purple colorway, the 990V4. He's going to be dropping over on the New Balance site. Uh, don't forget, um, the 30th. Uh, we got the Action Brunson New Balance, our second time to cop these. Of course, our first time uh, last week we copped over on the Specializing in Life foot site. I uh, did not end up getting a W. I hope we can hit. Uh, we did enter in as many raffles as we can get in. Uh, then we also got the Mellow uh, MB03, the Gutter Mellow. Uh, this one, I actually uh, like the silhouette of this one. I like it a lot better than the MB02. Uh, this one also going to be dropping on Friday as well. Uh, that Clot Nike Dunk Low uh, is going to be dropping on Nike Sneakers on Friday as well. Uh, this is the second place that has posted the Mine, baby. I think these are going to be dropping over the weekend as well. Uh, let's see uh, if tomorrow, uh, hopefully by Thursday, we should see something else. Uh, they will be dropping on a Mine site uh, first. I don't know if it's going to be a pop-up. Or we'll actually get online orders. Uh, we'll have to see, but I'll definitely let you guys know uh, as soon as we get the info. I hope they do. That would really put a little zap onto the week. The show. JC! <laughs> Let's go. Good morning. <laughs> J-Mac and Gubby. Gubby the puppy right there. There he is. Dun, da, 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 da. There he is. <laughs> Hell yeah. He's zapped. He's ready to go eat some liver. He loves liver. Don't you love liver? You love liver? He's hungry. Oh, no. There he goes. All right. All right. We're teasing now. We're teasing now. All right. Let's go ahead and pop on over here. Uh, let me go ahead and give a quick. Let's see what we got there. There we go. All right. All right. All right, yeah, make sure we got that on, um, got that muted over there. Okay, there we go, we didn't see that. Uh, we also uh, took a look at those albinos. I know we talked about the SB uh, lineup, uh, just two different things. We talked about the corn uh, collaboration, uh, corn Adidas collaboration. Uh, looks like that one is going to be dropping in October. 
Okay, this one gonna be dropping in October. My boy Guffy, <laughs> he's here. Oh man, he's just been running things around the block, doing his dog things, you know. <laughs> just big pimping out in the streets. <laughs> the show. All right, let's go ahead and uh, pop on over here. Uh, got the corn Adidas, and then we took a look at these bad boys, uh, the Albino and Preto, uh, Nike SB. Uh, these ones, again, we got tentatively set. Uh, we got a tentatively set date right here. Let's just pop that one open. Um, yeah, September. Looking like September. Nice little combo there. Uh, these ones. Uh, similar colors to the... The Horitos, um, but of course, the material is going to be different. This one going to be made out of that jiu-jitsu uh, material that they make the uniforms out of. Of course, the uh, Horitos ones were kind of made out of that hemp material or that uh, potato sack material. Unfortunately, the other day, uh, we were not able to pick up the FY7 uh, New Balance uh, collaboration. We are never able to get a pair of those. Uh, then we also got the uh, Travis Scotts. These are going to be dropping in October as well. Uh, that's going to be the Jordan 1 Low uh, Golf, of course. Um, let's pull those up side by side. Uh, that one is, is side by The Golf is side by side there with the Mocha. Just so you can kind of get a, a color uh, visual of it, the actual hue color. Of the upcoming Jordan 1 Low Travis Scott golf collaboration. And Guffy look great. Hey, thank you. He's a pretty handsome devil. <laughs> he Well, he did. He hurt his shoulder for about two weeks. And he was on some painkillers and some steroids there. Anti-inflammination or anti-inflammatory. <laughs> I probably missed the discussion. But how are y'all feeling about the um, um and year 17s? Uh, it's probably no for me. Oh, you! Yeah, I like them. I, I just, yeah. I don't really like the seventeen. I've never worn a Jordan above a fourteen. But there's something about that colorway, that kind of zap in in a whole different way. Yeah, those those are sauce. Um, I don't really like the speckled midsole, but yeah, we'll definitely be picking up a pair of these. They kind of give me those Soulfly vibes. Um, you know, we saw those Soulfly Jordan 13s. Of course, the colors are a little bit different, but just that off-white colorway, um, you know, they almost had similar, like the Soulfly Jordan 13s were um, kind of inspired by Michael Jordan's yacht and then, of course, the water. Um, these ones kind of got like a similar inspiration dealing with the beach. The blues, the creams. <laughs> Never worn anything above 13. Yeah. Yeah, it would be a first for me. I, I'm going to definitely do it. I like them. And I love all mom and year collabs. Hey, 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 put it this way. Remember I almost bought those Jordan courts? Because <laughs> when they, I thought they were an all mom and year collaboration. <laughs> but they were just an exclusive drop at all mom and year. Then we kind of backed up from it. We ended up not copping them. <laughs> but we almost even copped those, and those are terrible. That's one of the worst silhouettes. <laughs> Golly. Uh, once again, guys, uh, we did go over all of the Action Brunson uh, raffles as well. Uh, if you guys, some of you guys got here late, if you want to uh, scroll to uh, the be more towards the beginning of the stream, we did go over all of the raffles as well. Uh, they really try what to say. They are. Hey, man, I, I feel like they needed to do that to get, you know, because I wasn't going to cop just a general a GR colorway. However, we might get these first, might put them on foot. Hey, they might be the new thing. Who knows? <laughs> Who knows? We can probably kind of make them what we want them to be, huh? All right. All right. Let's see what else we got going on. Oh, over here, we got the April skateboard. Uh, dunk low. Um, I am interested in uh, the Mac Attack uh, social status collab. 
Uh, that is, that's going to be another one that I'll end up copping as well. Uh, let's go ahead and pop on over to the social status. Mac attack. Yeah, this will probably be the first uh, pairs that we get. Well, at least of the Mac attack. Dang, we got a gray one. We got a black one. Yeah, we got a few different colorways there. I'll, I'll definitely cop a Mac attack if if we get the collab. I think so. Wow, different color for all mom and year. No, no black and maroon, JC. Well, yeah, this one's uh, inspired by uh, their new uh, South Carolina beach location. That was kind of the, the color hues in this one. So a little bit different inspiration there. <laughs> Instead of, um, it's basically championship, because uh, I think they use the maroon colors uh, to kind of uh, put that edge on what the Jordan 1. We got the Jordan 1, Jordan 2, Jordan 3, and then the Jordan 4. We're going to get the Jordan 5s in that maroon color. So I think he's going to go back to him. Maybe this one kind of remind him more of like a, a drop top. A little convertible here. Was thinking beach. Drop top. <laughs> so I went with a, a crazy different color. But yeah, it seems kind of strange. You know, if it's not all black or black maroon. Yeah, the all mom and ear colorways. I like it though. I like going out the comfort zone a little bit. Absolutely, uh, I just got here and I was going to back to see what y'all been talking about. Um, yeah, not too, not too much on the drop side. We've been talking about more of the um, leaked images, uh, some of the new images that we saw uh, in about the last forty-eight hours since the last time we were live. Uh, we're getting caught up with that. We also went over uh, all of the raffles as well. So if you guys are uh, looking to uh, enter in for that Action Brunson nine nine zero V six. Uh, we went over all of the open raffles. Uh, once again, just to go over them real quick, uh, we got End Clothing. Uh, got the raffle up. Uh, SNS uh, in the app it has the Action Brunson raffle. And then Kith also uh, is now opened uh, for the uh, Action Brunson uh, New Balance 990 V6. Uh, then we also have BSTN. We also have BSTN, Up the Restore, Amal Minier, and Social Status. And um, I'll definitely let you guys know uh, as uh, any uh, continue to open up in the next uh, day or two. You know it. All right. All right. Let's go ahead here and pop on over. I think that is... Going to almost wrap it up today. Um, we do, uh, in the next week, uh, start to... Um, we'll get that uh, foam posit uh, colorway in the metallic red. Also this week, uh, the Jordan 2, Kawhi 54, and the Air Jordan 7 uh, infrared as well. Uh, we're also getting another colorway, the Jaw. Uh, next month. Remember, guys, the UNC Jordan 1s, uh, those did get delayed till the 22nd. Those are going to be dropping the day after uh, the born and raised Nike SBs. So July, things are going to really, really start heating up. You know it. I really hope uh, that we get the Aminés uh, soon as well. Uh, the Amine 610s. There we go. Let's go to what's just dropped. All right. We've already went over that. Upcoming releases. All right. What are you barking at, bud? Okay. All right, so yeah, we'll keep an eye on uh, the 610s. Uh, that would definitely be 
Awesome that they added that one on to the weekend. Uh, but, of course, on the 30th on Friday, we also got uh, the Action Brunson 610s. Of course, we did, or sorry, the Action Brunson 990 V6. Uh, we did get entered in uh, most of these raffles. Again, uh, it's more open. I'll definitely uh, go live and let you guys know. Uh, right now, we're entered into, uh, I believe I'm entered into all of them. I entered into social status on Mom and Year. I'm entered in Kith and Clothing. SNS. The only one I didn't enter in is is Up the Restore and BSTN. Those are the only two we did not enter uh, as far as the uh, Action Brunson uh, sneaks are concerned. Yes, sir. All right. And we also, probably another highlight uh, this morning, uh, the Supreme... Uh, collaboration set to drop in spring 2024 of uh, the Nike SB Darwin Low. If you guys remember, Dennis Rodman wore the Darwin Highs uh, back in his playing days. It's got that reverse swoosh. I think this is going to be such a sweet collab. I can't wait for that one as well. Uh, Mischief, this, this collab is going to be special. The Kid Cudi Mischief uh, collab. This one going to be a problem, I feel like, uh, as well. Um, then on the Yeezy uh, side of things, on the Yeezy side of things, we go on down here. We got a couple uh, pretty good slide colorways uh, as well as foam runners. Uh, we got the granite slides coming up. It looks like we're going to have uh, a similar Yeezy day uh, for the next drop. That's what... At least has been swirling around the internet. Uh, we got a couple of the marble colored uh, Yeezy foam runners as well. Uh, then we also got the uh, the gray foam runner uh, that's going to be dropping. I believe it's granite. Um, it was definitely a, a nice, nice colorway. Oh, that one's Stone Sage. On that one. There they are. Oh, the Stone Sage colorway. Let me just go ahead and pop on over here. All right, let's go ahead and pop down. The earthly reflective. Okay, we got a few colorways that... Uh, I haven't seen the colorway, so I'm um, just kind of based on what's been out there. Um, looks like another Adidas Yeezy sneaker uh, sale is coming. Um, I'm more interested in the gray stuff. I uh, like that gray, uh, the granite 350. I like the granite slide a lot. Uh, we got a couple of these marble colored slides as well. Uh, those are going to be passes for me. We also got a couple of the marble nifty 350s. Um, got some decent slide colorways coming. We got kind of this sand colorway. Uh, we got a sweet gray colorway. I don't I, I don't really like the mar these marble colorways. But I, I do get down with I do get down with the gray colorways. All right. Yeah, probably probably my favorite being the the granite slide. But we did we did just get a bunch of uh, slides in. Uh, we got the blue one. Uh, we hit on the blue one. I got a couple of the bone ones. I got a a, a tan color. Uh, we got the glow greens. We should be good on, on those ones. I'm going to use the, that bone colorway uh, to trade those bad boys out. 
Definitely going to use those bad boys as trade bait. Uh, we also got a couple of the foam runners on this last rip. Uh, I had a couple of the Onyx pairs I was holding from last year as well. Uh, the only pair they ended up not giving me is, unfortunately, the <laughs> 350 that I really wanted to put on foot. But uh, we did not get that one in. There we go. Uh, everything else came um, came in pretty quick. All right, we talked about the corn. Let me just go ahead and take a look. Unfortunately, guys, unfortunately, I just wanted to talk about, of course, uh, the delay on the Rommel Z Supreme Nike SB. Of course, those were set to drop tomorrow. Or, sorry, not next month. They were set to drop in July, tentatively set for July 7th. Uh, they did get pushed back, but uh, they're going to be dropping uh, the holiday 2023, uh, which we have a ton of good stuff already dropping. Hey, sir, bongs a lot in the house. <laughs> Let's go. Maybe getting after it this morning. All right. Yeah, that's that's really the only bad news we had this morning. Uh, the New Balance is dropping the three-piece Angora set on the Nifty 650. Some of you guys might be calling it the not-Nifty 650. Uh, but nonetheless, getting uh, three new colorways on this bad boy. Uh, after that Ame Leandor collab, now they're going to start raining the 650s on us. Of course, we got that Bodega Adidas Campus 80 uh, collab over the weekend as well. I'll definitely be looking for this Supreme uh, Nike SB Darwin. This might be my favorite sleeper shoe. Most definitely. This might be one of my favorite sleepers. Oh, man. I hope they don't butcher it, though. I hope they don't butcher it. Probably the two shoes that got me most excited are both the Darwin, the Supreme Darwin Nike SB collab and the Mischief. Uh, Kid Cuddy collab. Yep. And I totally butchered where I had it. All right. Yeah, the, the Cuddy collab. On the mischief. Uh, and then, of course, uh, Utopia, Travis Scott site. Uh, does have a place uh, holder up on his site. Uh, I can't wait until uh, the collaboration between SB uh, and him drop as well. Uh, again, Friday, we got Bend Over Becky uh, Blasey dropping the ashtrays uh, this week. Uh, on Friday, we got the Palace WWF collaboration as well. If anyone is looking for some of that drip. Uh, my favorite, probably favorite shoes... Uh, looking forward, uh, going to be that Mischief, uh, Cuddy, and then uh, the Darwin SB. I'll also throw the Am Amonier in there as well. I got to throw the Am Amonier in there. Even though it's a Jordan 17, there's got to be a first for everything. Got to be a first for everything. All right. And that is uh, looking like... That's going to be a wrap. Um, of course, then we got the, the Crocs. Big yellow boot. <laughs> we talked about those a little bit. Uh, last a stream. There we go. All right. Let me just go pop over here. Uh, anyone got anything else they want to add, talk about? Uh, feel free uh, to ask any questions. There we go. Smoke puff clouds in the chat. <laughs> we getting after it this morning. It's foggy in here. Sheesh. All right. Let's go ahead and pop on over. Uh, I saw Sneaker Freaker asked a question. What's the coolest collab of 2023 so far? We can leave on this note. We can leave on this note. What do you guys think? Coolest collab of 2023. There's been a lot of them. Um, I'm thinking... Let's see, the bricks. I mean, just some some low-key ones. We had 
The Jordan 3 Reimagined. That wasn't really a collab. That was a good shoe, though. Um, we had the Bricks and Woods. We had the Alma Manier Jordan 12s. We had the Union KOs. I would probably put the Nike SB, before we look at this, probably the Nike SB 4. I would put the Alma Manier 12 on there as well. Um, I would have to put the J-Tips Saucony on there. I would put that Kith A6 on there as well. And then, I would, of course, I'd have both colorways of the Action Brunson. You know it. Both of those on there. Um, and then I would have the Cortez Air Max 95. The Cortez Air Max 95 is a great one. We got the SB4. Oh, we. Yeah, and then we also had the Fly Streetwear. SB, I wouldn't put that one up there. We've had some good ones. Let's go ahead and take a look at what they what they said. Ooh, they got the Cortez on there. Ooh, they also got the Kith on there. All right, they got the Kith. Uh, Ronnie Fee Clark's triple collab. They got the Cortez on there. Uh, I wouldn't put the Sandy Ling Solomons on there. No way. There's no way that those are better than the Lorenzo. No way. Not even better than the Jound. I, I have a big problem with that one. They're not even close to these. Okay, those are way better. Uh, and then the Jound, Solomon. Yeah, I don't like that Solomon choice. That is just some hot garbage. We'll throw that shit away. Yeah, no. <laughs> no. Um, and then we got, of course, the Action Brunson one's really good. Really good. Um, you know, I like where they're going with it, although they're, they didn't add any of the Jordan collabs, you know, so we definitely would have to go back to the, to the board because there's, you got to put the, you got to at least put the all mom in here, the white color one up there for sure. I would even put the, I would maybe put the Kith, Kith age. <laughs> you should just name all the shoes you like them. Not the best, my boy. Right? Yeah, I should have kept just naming all the ones I like, for sure. Yeah, I would say, uh, I would say the SB four, the Cortez, the Action Brunson. Um, um, that I I really like that Amine six ten. Uh, but as far as stuff, I mean the Sambas. Are interesting. Um, but yeah, the Solomons, I would put the Jound. And I would put the... The Lorenzo Solomon uh, over both of those. Those Sandy Lang ones, for sure. And then, of course, we've had some some good uh, Jordan ones that I haven't been able to get my hands on either. But I, I got to think about this one a little bit more. Just off the top of my head, those were kind of the ones I was thinking about. Um, but most of those are just stuff that's been dropping in the last couple months. Uh, of course, my memory, uh, my short-term memory is uh, not very good, and my long-term is even worse. <laughs> For sure. Yeah, the Spidey. Yeah, I'm definitely going to have to go go and uh, take a... Take a yeah, take a look at everything once again. That we had, because a few things, I, you know, a few things that dropped uh, early in January, February, I might have forgotten, but from the stuff I do remember, I would say SB4, Action Brunson, Cortez. Got to be up there. All right. All right. Uh, with that said, I think that uh, here. Let me let me go ahead and take a look here. Make sure I'm not missing anything. All right. Let's go ahead. Let me just pop this up, so this can play in the background. Uh, yeah, we got the website updated. We talked about that. Uh, looks like uh, pre-orders available. We're just interested in the in the shoes. <laughs> There we go. Fans uh, chasing Playboy Cardi. 
Playboy Cardi rejected Nardwar. Nardwar was trying to interview him, <laughs> and he gave him <laughs> gave him the cold the cold shoulder. And Nardwar was done. Those gloves are fire. Louis collection looking looking real good. Uh, pink tapes dropping on Friday as well. Not only not only do we got. Uh, our, all of our sneakers, we got the Action Brunsons dropping on Friday. We got the Uzi Vert pink tape. We got the Clot Dunks. It's definitely going to start heating up, guys. It'll definitely start heating up as we get into the weekend. Take a look at this. We got West Side Gun rocking a new pair of those cold walls. That's another. That's a good one as well. That cold wall Air Max Plus in that blue colorway, I need those. I like those just as much as I like the Action Brunsons. Matter of fact, those go hard. Those go hard. I saw Salehi uh, out of the three pairs of shoes he was rocking in Paris. Uh, he had his Salehi 1906s. He also had that pair, and then he had a pair of uh, his Crocs. But yeah, those those blue cold walls, uh, Air Max Plus, those slap a certain way as well. A really dope, uh, dope picture here. I would imagine that he was probably wearing a baklava. How he got the color. But those, yeah, those egg-shaped glasses Pharrell wears with the diamonds around him. That's a sweet picture. Uh, and then No Sleep, Rave Club, Adidas. Uh, we took a look at a uh, couple different uh, colorways there. They did one colorway on the... Uh, Campus 80, and then, of course, you can see there, they did another colorway on the Superstar. Uh, that one is dropping on Thursday. Uh, but other than that, that is uh, about it. Oh, shit, someone threw their mom ashes on the stage while Pink was performing? <laughs> no way. Not the mom's ashes. Oh, <laughs> She goes gross. Oh, man. I would have. <laughs> Yo, I would have had to have just kind of walked out at that point. <laughs> she, she just puts it back down on the front. <laughs> there we go. Yeah, don't do that to your mom. Uh, mama's ashes right there. Yeah, she's like, yuck. Antibacterial, anyone? <laughs> Antibacterial. Pink looking like she gained a little weight there, huh? Getting into her mid-40s now. Still looking pretty good. Still looking pretty good. All right. There we go. That, it looks like about it uh, for today. Oh, no. A uh, man got too litty out in Jamaica. He tried uh, to drink all 21 cocktails on the menu on a Jamaican vacation. Got a little faded there. Faded on another le another level. All right, guys. Uh, that is uh, going to be up. Uh, that is going to be it for today. I uh, appreciate you guys again uh, for rocking with us today. Thank you guys so much for slapping those buttons. Uh, turning on the notifications uh, really, really helps get our videos in the algorithm. Uh, helps the channel grow. I really, really appreciate you guys uh, for that. Again, have a good rest of the day. Uh, once again, it's been your boy J-Mac. No drama, just commas. On to the next one. Whoop, whoop. <laughs> Eliante pulling up, feeling like Harry Belafonte. Uh, look at my racks, feel like Serena went hit from the back.